Welcome back, guys, to The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Well, last episode, after destroying the Gamma Cove Battle Talus, we reached East Nakluda's coastline and found our next memory, witnessing as Sonya was caught by treachery as Ganondorf obtained what he desired in the distant past. We then arrived at Lurilin Village, engaging its occupying forces with more than half of its troop dispatched as we now continue the fight. At the time you were planning to find a completely different geoglyph and use that to figure out what you were supposed to do? Yeah, it probably was. <laughs> I just wanted to move away from the area, though, is basically it. I also remember that I said that now. No, no, I didn't say that. Alright, let's plan our advance from up here by the look of things. So you have spotted me? Okay, here we go. Did I really miss? Uh, are we not firing electric anymore? Seemingly not. Okay, I regret that. <laughs> I regret that a little bit. It seemed like a good idea at the time. Is someone this side? I think there is, you know. That would be a yes. It's got a bouncy weapon. How dare you get away? Come on, come here. Get got. Okay, our silver dude's still hanging out over there. That guy's dead now via fire. Only the main man's left? And that's the pirates of Lurlin Village. I can't hear the monsters anymore. What? The monsters are gone! Oi! Rosal, everyone! It's safe to come back now! I, 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 the items! <gasps> can't be! Those horrible monsters are- They're all gone, every last one of them! Uh -huh. I, I saw everything from the house where I was hiding. This lone warrior type showed up out of nowhere and took out every monster in the village all by himself! Uh -huh. Whoa, I can hardly believe it! It's Bolson! You look like a strong breeze could blow you over, but you are solid as stone. Extraordinary. That is what you are. Oh. Thank you. I was so relieved that everyone in the village escaped uninjured. But still, it was awful. All we could do was watch as the monsters overran our home. If you hadn't come, this village might have been ruined beyond repair. I mean, it kind of is. We all owe you a great debt. Thank you so much. Oh. The good news is not all the houses have been destroyed. If we all work together, I'm sure we can rebuild. Anyway, I'll fix up all the houses the monsters destroyed. This kid's act of chivalry has lit a fire under me. I'm ready to get to work, baby. Oh. 
Oh. Bolson, you're only a visitor, and yet, what can I say but thank you? Oh. I'm sorry, but I don't have anything I can give you as a reward. Not with our village in shambles. Of course, once the village is rebuilt, we'll be sure to show you just how warm our hospitality can be. Yes, I'm hoping we can repay you for all you've done. One day, eventually. Oh. Now listen, everyone. Lowland Village has been given a chance at a fresh start. If we all do our part, I know we can bring this baby back from the brink. So get ready, because old Bolson here is going to keep you busy until this village is rebuilt. Looks like I have to do quests for it. <laughs> That's for sure. Thank you, Metal Son. <laughs> One of Bolson's son sons. <laughs> well, finished attack by Pyrus is done. We now have to go report to Mubs and Garini. <laughs> now the Pyrus are gone, even the air itself feels clean again. Truly, I can can't thank you enough. <laughs> Where you fought those pirates, it was incredible, awe-inspiring. And now that you've driven them out, it's my turn to get to work. Mm. Yes, the pirates may be gone, but that doesn't mean we can roll out the welcome mat yet. Huh. We have to do something about the state of the village, or no one will return home. Oh. Don't you worry, I might not look it, but I know a thing or two about construction. Besides, I owe you. No, I owe this whole village for taking me in. And I pay my debts, it's kind of my thing. Mm. Also, this village has charm. I can't wait to restore the restaurant and the lucky treasure shop to their former glory. Oh. Uh, materials might be an issue, though. See, I'm going to need a rather large amount of logs and Hylian rice. And since I want to use the palm trees as central pillars in the buildings, the logs have to come from somewhere else. Huh? What did you say? No, I appreciate the offer, but you've already done so much. You drove off those awful pirates, after all. I couldn't ask an outsider to go to so much trouble for us. Oh. Now, now, if he's offering to help, who are we to say no? <laughs> As of today, you and me are pals. And because we're pals, I'm going to let you help me. Now that that's decided, I'm going to briefly go over everything on our to-do list. First, we're going to rebuild each bi destroyed building's foundation. Oh. So let's see. Yeah. I think you can collect 15 logs for me. That's what we'll need. And when I say logs, I don't mean ones from palm trees. I'm going to use those palm trees for something important. So get those logs from other trees, okay? Hmm. Also, I'm going to need 20 bundles of Hylian rice to repair the thatched roofs that were burned. You can handle that too. Thank you for everything. I won't be able to assist you myself. I'll be looking around and assessing the damage. Ma I'm going to call this project the Great Lurlin Village Revival. Our first collaboration. How exciting is that? <laughs> no pressure or anything, but I'll be counting on you. I really should have came to Lurlin earlier. Shouldn't I? <laughs> well, I might have the logs. <laughs> But I very much doubt I have the Hylian Rice. I'm pretty sure I picked up one Hylian Rice during that battle. I have three. We're gonna need to find some place to uh, find all this stuff, I feel. As for how I get up there while it's raining, the only way is up there again, right? Yes, he doesn't remember me, but then not to a lot of people by the look of it. <laughs> Link's strangely not very memorable for everything he does for everyone. I feel like it would be better if we were extorting people. <laughs> so something. <laughs> Maybe it's easier to be remembered if we do something negative than positive. You think he means actual logs, not wood, though? I mean... If he wants me to bring full logs, I can't take them in my inventory. I'm assuming he just means... That, but... Does he want me to stick 15 logs together? That sounds a little much. Anyway, I've got to get my goods over here. was melting then. <laughs> well, no matter what, I don't have 20 high in rice, so I can't do anything. Maybe I could just drop logs from above on him. <laughs> Watch out below! <laughs> Spomp!
actually curious. Do logs survive that? Well, I guess I better go to that shrine now, so at least we have the area. And we've been to Lurlin Village and got our memory, but, uh... Questions remain as to how we're gonna actually help this place. <laughs> Let's get to there. I could cut down trees and carry them. Sounds like too much manual labor to me. The main issue is the Hylian rice though. Wait, you can use the water to... What? Well, I'm never going to get there in time. It looked like the rain made that water go longer. Oh, look at these bundles of trees. Oh, stupid bundles of trees. I know you're... Yeager clan now. Guess these are the logs it means. What does that mean then? Do they just disappear after you cut them in half? <laughs> Did we just cut these people in half? Now I just feel like I should get the trees. I'm gonna think about the scenario here. I don't think they were talking about these trees. Oh, come on, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's unhelpful. That's unhelpful chat on that one. <laughs> you can go, oh, but not palm trees, but they're not logs. They're that's wood. No, no, but not these trees. It's like, no, no, shush. <laughs> no, 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 no. Luckily, we get the things from them. Building a raft. <laughs> Am I supposed to get enough? Oh. Stop it! Go away! <laughs> Squirt. Okay, come on, Yiga. We know you're in here. There they are. So now I'm cutting down trees. So yeah, like, I cut them in half. Well, we missed each other. We can both feel bad about ourselves. I wonder if I can deliver logs one by one or not. Stack them up. <laughs> so I keep carrying them in a longer fashion. It's going to look stupid by the end of this. Oh, well, that's 12 logs. He said 15. Hopefully he accepts them like this and I'm not just wasting time.
Right, before I go anywhere, I should activate the Sifumin Shrine so we have the warp here. I'm not going to go in it yet. Till we bring the logs down to the guys. Can I chuck the logs off the cliff without getting in trouble? Alright, there's some more... Like, where's the next best wood place? Over there? It's raining again. Oh, it's not lined up properly. Still isn't, but that'll do. It's better than it was before. Ah, so I can't really get them to there, can I? I'm going to hope that you take a running total of logs and that these don't break. Logs are very bouncy. <laughs> I'm amazed they didn't shatter. I have 12 logs. Why did you actually want them? Oh, oh, oops, sorry. Forgot about the motion controls. Smell high quality lumber? Oh. I did get right Ted gathering logs. Do you want 12? Seems someone works so hard in the rain even it warms my heart. Thank you. I'll be sure to take good care of this. Are you going to tell me you need three more specifically? Mm. As for getting after those logs, that makes 12 in our collection. Oh. Just three more and we'll have all the logs we need. And while you're at it, could you collect... Yeah, but that's where? Oh. Do you know a good place for it? Sometimes Heidi and Rice will turn up if you cut the grass, even around here. But it might be faster to buy it in my old hometown of Hateno Village. Oh. Okay, then. Hmm. The question is... Mm. Oh. Is it just faster for me to go to Hateno or not? <laughs> is, there my, is, there, is there just logs here for me to pick up? There are as well. Am I getting a bit ahead of myself? Going off and cutting them. When there are just logs here. I mean, no matter what, I needed to go out and cut some of them. Seems that we are now fully on it. We are... We are Hateno Village Collection Duty. These might be a little waterlogged. Oh. oh, you think it's high quality? or well, you smell it as high quality. Mm. Oh. Just one oh. more. One more! Oh. How much could I buy from Hateno Village? I guess I can't use these ones that are broken. Uh, nearest normal tree. I'm now kind of cursing the fact that I got those two free logs. Does he accept auto-built dogs? <laughs> I'd, um, hazard... Without actually knowing, I'd hazard a guess and say no. <laughs> Just a small thing of them being probably not a permanent thing. <laughs> but even I don't know if that's true or not. Hello, dragon flying by.
<laughs> Why'd you have to be one of them? I'm surprised you can just shrug off that attack. I'm not interested in you, bud. If I do this, where do you think it will go? <laughs> Rolls way worse than I thought it would. You attached wheels to your log and drove them to him? I like that solution. Made some kind of giant logmobile. <laughs> Ooh. That's actually a thing. What about Blood Moon? To restore my log supply would be nice, yeah. Fighting rice I'm worried about, though. I thought we'd, uh, we'd advance past grass cutting. <laughs> we grew past that in Zelda. <laughs> there you go, that's your last log. Only half of the logs somehow had Yika clan in them, which make you then wonder were they hollowed out or not? Oh. Oh. Alright, log's done. Let's go to Tenno Village and buy ourselves some stuff. Because I want to move this along. I don't even know where the grass is. <laughs> what does grass look like in Zelda now? I know I can set it on fire. Where's the dragon? Over there. Don't think we can reach you for anything else. You're upset, but you're not giving me a quest, so... Yeah! yeah. Hello! I need rice. <laughs> How much do you have? Oh. Five! Uh, You'll restock soon, will you? Five, man. It's not enough. Ooh, so that's what a shrine looks like when you haven't done it. Didn't know that. So we're at eight Hylian rice. Are you ready for grass cutting times? Where's the grass? I mean, this is grass, but this isn't cuttable grass. This concept is too confusing for me. It's too much. No! <laughs> uh, just when I thought things couldn't get worse. <laughs> The shrine imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. <laughs> Outside equipment is forbidden beyond this point. Proving grounds flow. Someone see me already? I'm stealth. No, 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 no. You didn't see me. Stop pretending you did. No, 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 no. That's it. I was trying to push him off the platform. Not working exactly as expected. Okay, so I'm being shot by like a billion dudes. That's not a good start. 
Uh, so there's no one over there, but there's stuff on that one. Well, I can't take these arrows from you. They can't hit me. Oh, shoot. They can't hit me. I was thinking he wouldn't be able to shoot me because he wouldn't be able to see me. Yeah, I've made it into the central reservation where more guys are shooting me. <laughs> it's me! Knock him into the water! It is the way! Take his stuff. Don't get electrocuted. Preferably. Oh, come on. Yeah. I'm liking that here. Lie down for a second. The idea really is to knock you into the water. Not this, but... Let's face it, I can also shoot you, and it works for me. So we've taken out all the ones on the outside. I guess I need to actually move this myself. What are you gonna do about the situation now, eh? You're down there, I'm up here. I'm feeling pretty good about myself. <laughs> I got the spike ball now. Wait, is the guy still alive? Can't be having that. So you're like a couple of knocks off from just going into the war. So that's, that's the game. Worked. I guess. Perfect, yeah, sure. It was just, uh, let's run around a bit, as is usual for that. Uh, pick up some resources. <laughs> kind of like... Quickly kill one guy and say, This stuff's mine now. Captain 4 Reaper. 63 power. I'll take that, thank you very much. Now I'll use it to get Hylian Rice, right? I grabbed all the platforms of Ultran as they float by and knocked them in the water. So funny. Wait a second. <laughs> I was like, I'll grab this box and knock them off due to the motion of the thing. Oh, it's already gone past now. That won't work now. So I'm just going to have the box in position so that the guy would then drag against the box, not the box hopefully pushing the motion to push him off. Yeah, I could have just grabbed the platforms and just rotated them. They'd all died. <laughs> the funny thing was, is I instantly went... Oh, they just died to death in the water, because I know that. And then I just didn't use it. I just went, I'm just going to kill you with arrows. That works. I think I should feel disappointed with myself on that one. Thanks, guys. You made me feel disappointed in myself. <laughs> I 
May the light of blessing grant you the strength you seek. <laughs> It would have looked so cool. Like, even later on, I was just like, I'll move the boat so I can get up into the middle. <laughs> I didn't even think, oh, I'll move the boat to get the enemies off of it. What? Even though, like, I'm, I've, I've said even before, oh, if I knock these guys in the water, they'll instantly die. Like the Bacoblins and all that that were in the area. What's wrong with me? Ow. Come on, brain. Right, so do I need to find long grass? Is this grass long enough? Oh, it's, it's grass long enough. Oh, here we go. I don't know if this hurts my weapon. Actually, I can find out. No. Ah, uh, cutting grass. The old noble pastime. I mean, with a scythe makes sense to try and get like rice, right? Not many areas with long enough grass, though. And I think the pop-in for grass is a bit... closer than you'd like. I know spin makes sense, but... I'm worried I'll bash into something and lose durability. It needs to be a certain length, right? It needs to be this length. How many do you reckon I've got now? Hello, long grass. I guess I should keep it in my uh, list here. 15. Oh, not that far off. Should have saved that rupees I had. I'm not doing well at catching the bugs that come out there, am I? Do you know what? I didn't even notice that this grass exists most of the time. Oh, I'll never take a picture of you. I didn't even look at my feet. Come on, guys, you got this. Oh, man, there's more of them. See, I'm out of here. Bye. <laughs> I need to get to where there's more grass. Unless you go. Ah, my weapon's on fire! 